for match day 11. It's an encounter between the home side, Bechem United, and the visitors, Techiman 11 Wonders. My name is Prince Anand. Thank you very much for joining us. We'll be running you through 90 minutes of nothing but action when it comes to the Ghana Premier League. I'll be doing this with my colleague, Professor Jude Achampong, and together we'll be bringing you up to speed with what you need to know how the teams are prepared for this uh, regional derby and, of course, what, what the stakes are in terms of high-high or how low it is. And then away we go for the commencement of this game here today. Fourth official, Salom Kwamekbe. Well, of course, of course. Um, uh, if you look at the um, home form of the Chem United this season, playing five matches, winning two and drawing two. There's an opportunity coming for 11 Wonders. Ashite Ole, Nules on the pass. And that is the first goal. Easy does it. For the gentleman you spoke about earlier on, he's not been producing the goals. He has proved us wrong here in commentary position. Samuel Boachi hits the target for 11 wonders. Boachi once again, can he take on his marker? Amponsa tries to go around him and the ball goes straight to the goalkeeper. And an opportunity now to see whether the defense will open up on the other side. Good opportunity, but good reflexes. But it's the end of the first half and Jude... Obviously, we've not seen anything from Bechim. And now defending from uh, right to left. It's a D ball now, Hafiz. Hafiz sends it across into the 18-yard box. Goalkeeper came out fair and square and made a solid save. After winning, you know, with the last kick in that game against Kim Faisa, all that he's telling his boys is to believe, have belief in themselves here. Looking for support and front player. Player goes down in the box and... Uh, Obviously, outside the box, substitution for Wonders will be taking place. Shot is fired on target, and it, way, it goes way out. Other than that, such strikes won't get you a goal. Bechem United, Charles Minson. Good recovery. Penalty. Yes, it is. Even from commentary position, it was that clear. Ball hit the hand. And that man knows that, look, you guys, he's taking a look at his watch. He knows that we have about 15 minutes or less. A goal now would put the pride back. Can he redeem the image? Can he bring Be uh, Bechem United back? One, two, three, and he does that. He has done what it matters most. He has done what it matters most. Get Bechem United back into the game. Still pushing men forward. The Tenorti still has it. Threads one into the 18-yard box. The header goes off target. That was Prince. Strong recovery from uh, Rashid. He's beaten to it. Bechem United coming forward into the 18-yard box. What a goal! What a goal! What a goal! The teacher says, this is my property. This is my land. And uh, Hafiz Konkone, he's the man who scored eight goals last season. Showing his true colors here at the Nana Fosu Jabo Park. Samuel Boache has decided to take a rest. And the fourth official has whispered something to uh, the referee. Well, are we going to see a card? Yellow card. Yellow card to Coach Ignatius. Third goal. Third goal. For Bechem United, he has uh, showed the reasons why he was brought on. And he's got his name on the score sheet for the home side. Bechem United cruising on. 3 1 advantage against 11 Wonders. It's Bechem United. Hafiz Kokori, can he make it for no? Goalkeeper. George Amaya with a brilliant stop. Like it's a free kick. Salifu will take it. No, he lifts it. And Prince Asampa will make a save. It's all over here at the Nana Fosujia Park. It's Bechem United 3, 11 Wonders 1.